Hey guys, welcome back to Next Gen Blog. And in this video, I want to show you how you can turn text in VSDC free video editor. So it's actually super easy to turn text in VSDC. So without further delay, let's get started and see how you can do this. Now, the first thing which we will do is we will create three different text objects in the timeline. And so to do that, first of all, go to add object, go to text, click on text and then click on OK. Now mark your text object on top of the screen and let's write some text inside the text box. So let me just write, let's say like and let me just center align my text box by clicking on this option, which is horizontal align center and then clicking on this option, which is vertical align center. Perfect. Now, currently the duration of my text object is 10 seconds. So I would like to decrease the duration of my text object from 10 seconds to three seconds. So let me just write zero three inside the duration option and then press enter. Perfect. Now let's create our second text object. So let me just go to add object once again, go to text, click on text and then click on OK. Now mark your second text object and let's write some text inside our second text box. So let me just write, let's say comment. And once again, let me just center align my second text box by clicking on horizontal align center and then clicking on vertical align center. Perfect. Now, let me just decrease the duration of my second text object from 10 seconds to three seconds. Perfect. And finally, let's create our third text object. So let me just place the cursor at six seconds and let's go to add object once again, go to text, click on text and then click on OK. Now mark your third text object on screen and let's write some text inside our third text box. So let me just write, let's say subscribe. And let me just center align my text. Perfect. Let me also decrease the duration of my third text object from 10 seconds to three seconds. Perfect. Now the next thing which we will do is we will overlap our first and second text object by one second and our second and third text object by one second. And so to do that, first of all, let me just pull down my second text object below like this and inside the time option, currently the time is set to three seconds. So let me just change this from three to two seconds. Perfect. And similarly, let me just pull down this third text object below like this. And the time inside my third text object is five seconds. So let me just change the time inside my third text object from five seconds to four seconds. Perfect. And so now what we will do to turn our text is first of all, double click on the first text object and then go to video effects, go to transforms, select skew and then click on OK. Now currently the duration of the skew effect is the entire duration of my text, which is three seconds. So decrease the duration of the skew effect from three seconds to one second and then place it right at the end like this. Perfect. Now look inside the skew settings, which is present inside the properties window and inside the vertical option currently false is selected. So change this from false to true. And inside the skew angles currently 30 degrees is selected. So first of all, change this from constant parameter value to linear parameter change so that we have two values, 30 semicolon 30. And now change the values from 30 semicolon 30 to 0 semicolon minus 90. Perfect. 
now let's go back to the main editing timeline now double click on the second text object and once again go to video effects go to transforms select skew and then click on ok now decrease the duration of this skew effect from three seconds to one second and look inside the skew settings vertical is already set to true so that's fine inside the skew angles currently the values are 0 semicolon minus 90 so change the values from 0 semicolon minus 90 to 90 semicolon 0 perfect and so now if i just quickly play the video for you so this is how you can turn your text perfect and what we will do is double click on this second text object once again and we will add another skew effect so go to video effects go to transforms select skew and then click on ok and um, the duration of this skew effect which i just created is 766 milliseconds so increase the duration to one second and then place it properly right at the end like this and um, look inside the skew settings vertical is already set to true inside the skew angles currently the values are 90 semicolon 0 so change the values to 0 semicolon minus 90 perfect now go back to the main editing timeline and double click on this third text object which you created and right here also we will add a skew effect so go to video effects go to transforms select skew and then click on ok decrease the duration of the skew effect to one second and place it at the beginning now look inside the skew settings vertical is already set to true inside the skew angles currently the values are 0 semicolon minus 90 so change the values from 0 semicolon minus 90 to 90 semicolon 0 perfect and so now if i just quickly play this entire thing for you so this is how you can turn text in vscc free video editor perfect what you can also do is you can add a fade in effect so double click on the first text object and go to video effects go to transparency go to transparency and select fade in and then click on ok and so now if i just once again quickly play this entire thing for you perfect perfect so this is how you can turn your text in vscc free video editor do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see you in the next video Till then, thanks for watching.